All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Phantom Liberty. Let's, uh, oh, what's this? I didn't notice this. I just component. Go get this chrome installed. You, Farida? Yes, and we're closed. Got something might interest you? I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification war era. Mm-hmm. Come in. There we go. I'm sorry I was unwelcoming. Ever since a certain space plane crashed nearby, I've had to be more cautious. Oh, I bet. V, good to see you. Who would have thought? Uh... <laughs> Here to see me? Things are in flux. The situation's changing faster. I thought we should talk. Alright. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this, putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through, too. To resort to treason. You're in no position to understand, Reed. Your life ain't on a timer. But I know death. Stared him in the eyes up close. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually years. I blame Myers, a sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, the Black Wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone. Except maybe you. A little. Song should trust you, not me. That it? I can't say I really blame her. I can only blame myself. But could you have done anything differently? Something. Anything. Instead of giving in and being exiled in Night City a couple thousand miles away. 
There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her alive, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life. Never. Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can't. So me tried to kill you too. You work for Myers. What you trying to sell me, Reed? Nothing. I'm merely trying to convince you. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? We stow away somewhere safe. Ask some questions. Establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help her disappear. From everyone, everywhere, including Myers. Wanna ask her a few questions, huh? To understand her side. Got an idea already of what I'll hear. System broke her. Almost took her life. Like it did mine. As for me, well, my time's well past. But so is still worth saving. You know, some would call that treason. Tell me something I don't know. I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic, put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Somi first. She's lost. I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black wall and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. So me... She reached out. Wasn't telling the whole truth before. Once out, off the grid. As it planned for right after we take down Hanson. Gonna make a run for it. Slip out of Night City. I... Thank you, V, for your candor. This means a lot to me. I have something for you. Our best minds in D.C. cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida or feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. She could sense the breaker. Not talking about some run-of-the-mill runner here. It's meta-heuristic, hyper-aggressive tech, cobbled together by a literal army of experts. If she does sense it, it won't matter. No one out there, alone, could withstand somebody like this. You sure this soft will work? Doubt it's been tested on anyone at Songbird's level. From what they tell me, this program can anticipate what she'll do before she even thinks to do it. By the time you cut one thread, it's already found another. A precision-guided weapon designed to evade countermeasures. Okay. How do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. Oh boy, um, hope you've got this right. You two just can't talk. I know, right? They probably should. This is gonna turn to shit. Two of you could just, you know, sit down, talk it out. That's my aim. Precisely. After you kidnap her. Not quite the same. We've come to a point where some options are simply off the table. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. It's time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, the sooner we finish. 
I need to do anything, or...? Twenty questions first? Should I hold your hand? No. Do nothing. Tush? Meet chair. Okay. Anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. This tech... I actually heard about it. Back at our Osaka counter intel. We thought I got the chop at the prototype stage. As you can see, it yet lives. Chatterbox. Chatterbox. Just be in front of you. Okay. Anesthesia is taking hold. Shit, did she just straight up take off my face? How many fingers am I holding up? <laughs> nice to see you in good form. Mm -hmm. You want something from me? To chat. Got no other options. You'll have to do. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? Interesting way of saying undercover FIA agent. Shit, actually butt into this. They send you to a fancy party, stroke your ego, and now you're some kind of super spy? What's next? Fucking gold medal? Ticker tape parade? A statue? A national holiday? Kids home from school? What the fuck? But seriously, found yourself in a shitastic situation. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. Think one of them's trying to dupe me? No, they're both telling the truth. I mean, might be muddy on the nitty gritty, but their motivations are plain and clear. Survival. It's her be-all and end-all. That and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a Reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. Someone's gonna play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. What would you do if it were me? If you were me? Reed? Or Songbird? What would you do in my shoes, Johnny? I am in your shoes, dumbass. For every gonk choice you make. But I can't do dick. But honest to God, V, not fucking around? I don't know. Got no goddamn clue. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Might pop by if I need anything else. 
I can't wait. That's gotta hurt like a bit like... Oh, it's a new part of cyberware. Interesting. Wait, did that do something? No? Hey, procedures are up. V, I hope you're not feeling too raw post Farida's work. It's time to intercept and supplant the Netrunners. Just one hiccup. Our access to Karen Exotics was cut. They must have discovered us. Wait, seriously? So we lost them? Not entirely. We know they were last in the city center. Headed out direction. Find a vantage point near the entrance of Dogtown. You'll grab a trace on the runners as they drive to the meeting. Okay, well, we're... Oh, actually very close. Uh, it's game time, everything's online. But I'm with you all the way, okay? I'm going anywhere. We need you dialed in on the mission. Don't overanalyze, don't hesitate. Uh, yeah. Get everything inside. I don't know what that last part means. Clean so far. Oh, that looks like a convoy. See a convoy. Hanson's goons. Doubt the runners would have a security escort, though. I'll keep watching. Additional support for the stadium, most likely. No visual on our targets. Still nothing. Okay, I guess they're all coming from this way. No sign of their ride. No visual on our targets. Got a total Cortez blocking the road. Traffic's piling up. First basic, run of the mill. Definitely not them. And we keep looking. There they are. No question. Both runners are inside. Got the signal? Got it. Not gonna slip off our radar anymore. Good work. Still early for the beam of Hansen. They'll stop. Kill time somewhere. Okay, they're stationary. And out of the car. Walking towards the club now. V, you're clear to head for the car. Get to it. Um, I don't have a waypoint. Oh, it's down.
Oh, turn it. Here we are. Damn. Free ride. Hey, get out there at the window shop. Smooth sailing so far. Cam feeds are mine. Good. Last check now. Make sure you're ready to roll. Alright, just cycle through the different car cameras. Should be good, just give me one sec. Why? What are you doing? Tweaking the ice. Kinda half baked way it's set up now. Fine. Just no unnecessary risks. And done. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Now we wait. Our VIPs are back. They're about to get in. Time to focus up. Kurt Hansen, tu l'as vu, non? Il était grave en train de me relooker au Saphir. Que ce soit cette putain de gueule de bois, oh, ça tourne de partout, dans tous les sens. T'en penses quoi De Hanson, je veux dire. Ok, V, take control. La voiture, quelqu'un en a pris le contrôle. Fabrique, sonne l'alarme On a besoin d'aide Je vais localiser le vecteur. Ok, seconde C'est fait Putain, allez J'essaie de reprendre le contrôle
Et merde Quoi Putain, qu'est-ce qui se passe Non, non, non Wow What the fuck What's the shit Fuck You wiped him What do you think we would do Bind their hands with duct tape, shove socks in their mouths, and wait for them to wriggle free and call for help? This ain't no game, V. It's a simple choice. Them or us. I chose us. Alex, you knew about this! This execution! Of course I knew. Textbook move. Not exactly my first mission, V. Call like that comes with the territory. It is a game. Your fucking spy game they weren't playing. They were innocent. That's not quite how I'd describe two pro criminals. These innocents, as you call them, wouldn't hesitate to rob you for everything you've got, or put a bullet in your back. Alright, we have fresh disguises already. But you still need to lift the access codes off them. Aurora's the one to check for those. Jesus Christ. Put on the Netrunner outfit. <sighs> this feels so fucked up. Expect me to believe you've never taken anything off a body before? Uh, I have, but... Sure she's the one with the codes? Definitely. Her brother transfers his memories to external data banks, and he's had these stolen before. They wouldn't risk losing these codes. Right, codes transferred. Fucking hell, man. Taking the wheel. Your imprint now. Check, check. Oh, shit, my voice. <laughs> nice. Hang on, that's me. What the hell? Dream, right? Give it a whirl. Introduce yourself. Huh. A little miracle must do more than morph your face and voice. Gotta fuck with your hormones like a designer drug. Give you hyper-specific highs and lows to change your behavior. Mm-hmm. Establishes a new baseline. You just gotta say the right words. Okay, here goes. Aurore Cassel. Who the fuck is asking? Hmm, not bad. It can feel like a real trip at first, but you'll get used to it. Take a sec, collect yourself, then we move. Hansen's waiting. Alex, it just hit me. This'll be our last stop together. I haven't forgotten our deal. My eyes greenlit it. A diplomatic mission, no end date. Call it early retirement. Thanks much, Reed. Are you ready to fuck shit up? Good. Sound just like her. Any pre-op jitters? Kinda. I guess. But? Hearing a butt in there. It's just... 
More than anything, I miss this. Okay, let's get to it. All right, stadium then. See you there. a little refresher before we arrive. Remember, name's Aurore Cassel. Let me let you in on my secret about how to be someone else. Ask yourself three questions. What do they fear? What do they want? What's their deepest secret? Okay. Got that? Don't answer now, just something to keep in mind. And be her. So, Aurore, your thoughts on Hansen? Tell me. Oh la la, the bastard is king of his realm. He is too big, too strong to be removed. Not by the powers in Night City, not by the NUS. The locals think, ah fuck it, he's okay. And the NUSA? Impotent. It cannot challenge Night City over one man and broken buildings. Man, couldn't agree more. Plus, I like his massive balls. <laughs> Not a metaphor. The actual coconuts in his pants. <laughs> Uncanny and disturbing. Spot on all. Good work. We have arrived. The hound's den. In possession. Ready for the next phase. Talk soon. Stop your vehicle. Prepare to have it inspected. You are good. Come on through. Let's go. Park. Before we go in, remember, he wants something from us, not the other way around. We are here to sell him Sinoshore mainframe access codes. Stick to the facts. Know who you are and are not. Uh, okay, so press that to display, display important information about the net. Oh, okay. We are here. Don't lose your goat, Emmerich. Oh my god. Fuck, we're doubling up at every post. Believe that? Something has hands in our tents. So do I get to like use this to get away from the cops? Secure area, folks. We have a meeting with Colonel Hansen. Checking now, need a sec. Good, you made it. We haven't met yet. Name's Murphy. Oh, that's finished this quickly. My hangover is killing me. This way. All right, we're in the belly. So, Songbird told me a little about you. Said you two hail from Europe. That's right. And... Did you enjoy yourselves at the Sapphire? Police commissioner, a candidate for mayor, the Tiger Claws bookkeeper. All gambling on the city's future together. Figuratively, and not. The anatomy of corruption is beautiful here. Uh, uh yeah. 
Took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> okay, here's our stop. You should expect to have eyes on you all day today. Of course. Kurt got a tip. The FIA plans to pull some gonk move. Situation's under control. He ordered everyone checked out, though. No exceptions. Many wish your colonel dead. He must be vigilant. Got our people manning the whole stadium. Drone aided scans providing surveillance support, too. Need you to leave your weapons here. Next, we'll need to run some ID scans. Joke around as we might, get along as we do. Ultimately, this is a place of serious business. You understand? Of course, of course. This here's the heart of our little empire. Ah, how you sell these war machines? It's like a car salesman? Kinda, <laughs> yeah. But wholesale only. Suppose you're a dictator from some rinky-dink country. I don't know. Australia, let's say. Tanks, choppers, subs. You want it, we got it. No red tape. You have submarines! Fresh out, but we sure did. Damn, okay. All right, I'm in position. Preparing our evac route now. Take your time. I need ten more minutes at least. Not much further now. I couldn't get started earlier without risk of being compromised. Understood. And the roar? It should go without saying. But stay in character. Of course, obviously. Good luck. Has this way. Done since, since the beginning? Since the op in Night City, you mean? You could say that, but we served together earlier, too. I see. Then he must trust you very much. Pleasure to see you both. Songbird needs a moment to disarm the device. Which gives us a chance to chat. Oh, please, there is no need to hurry. We have a terrible hangover. Both of you? A bit of rhetoric. Emmerich doesn't drink, but when I do, both of us suffer. Well, we'll fix that right quick. Do you often conduct business hungover? My first time. I give you my word. I'm sure it is. I know you don't believe me. But I do. Truly? Yet even I do not believe me. As you can see, Colonel Anson, we sometimes lack a soldier's discipline. But with unique flaws come unique strengths. I have no doubt. I'd like to raise a little toast to a successful day of business. Well said, Colonel, well said. I am starting to like it here. To your health. I must decline. It's changing the subject. Did you enjoy yourselves at the Sapphire? My people tell me the stakes went high. You two left richer and happier, I hope. I thought it a night at a casino. Wine and cash until both ran out. But then, this new piece of ass joined our table. I know the one. Thanks to them, winner, winner, chicken dinner. The Black Sapphire. My pride and joy. 
I worked hard to make it the go-to destination for Night City's royalty. Oh, actually, before I forget, I learned recently that we have a mutual friend. She said you did time together at La Sante. Remembers you well. My, you must have an impressive set of contacts, Colonel. And just who is this friend who remembers me so well? Raquel. Asked me to say hello. She did her time under max security, C-block. Said her rat tattoo might jog your memory. <laughs> this Raquel is clearly mistaken. Max security is separate from the VIP wing where I stayed. <laughs> Thank God. Ah, it must have been someone like you. Very much like you. Indeed. How many years have you been in Night City? They say you served with Militech once. Seven years now. And yes, before that it was my mission to plant an NUS flag on this soil. Then it appears to be a great success. The things you have achieved here. Impressive. That flag's a piss-soaked pile of ash now. What I built, I built with my own two hands. For me. Why did you change sides? Because I don't need a convenient ideology to hide my business behind. I tossed the flag, but the suits in DC still remember me. President Myers, too? She called just six months ago, in fact. Asked me to help with a mess she couldn't clean up herself. Bureaucracy, red tape, and all that. Interesting. Interesting. And uh, she calls, still? Not lately. Her administration recently encountered some uh, turbulence along its path. Ah, uh, by the way, at the Sapphire, you asked me to contact a certain fashion type. Remind me who? Ah, oh, the tailor of Kerry Eurodyne. Oh, he is so flavorful. Mm, I must have a taste. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yes, that's the one. The fashion world isn't exactly my forte, so I'll need maybe a week to arrange it. Your sister certainly is the more talkative of you two. You noticed? You compliment each other well. Listen, it seems we've got time to spare. There's another opportunity I'd like to discuss. An expansion into Western Europe. What I need is a reliable partner on the ground. Two would be even better. Ooh, I have butterflies. A lucrative opportunity? <laughs> but I shouldn't sugarcoat it. I'm asking for a lot of hard work. Comms channels, supply chains, secure transport routes, the good graces of local authorities. These things I have. The groundwork is laid. Then what more do you need from us? I need an inn with Les Collectifs. Oh, we could do that. <laughs> Anyone with even a bit of cred in France knows who they are. We can put you in contact, easily enough. Oh, is that so? Just like that? Yes, I and Le Collectif, we are very close. Hmm. Close, sure, but not on the best terms from what I know. Uh, just like you and the NUSA. They say to the world they would put you down. In fact, they leave you a bowl of food by the back door. I see what you mean. You got a visit? Ah, so me. We can begin. The mainframe is ready. You remember the terms. One of you feeds in the access codes, the other stays with me. I will stay. Shall we? Follow me. Jesus, really bored down. So tell me, how do you like NC now that you're back? While you are waiting, I ran some initial diagnostics. The mainframe is prepped and linked with our systems. She's ready to go. Excellent. 
You know, he created this lab especially for the occasion. Tens of millions of eddies invested for your visit alone. That's Kurt for you. What, prompt and effective? <laughs> I have a plan in place for when we secure the neural matrix. I'll hack the local net, override its defense systems, turn the whole stadium hostile. We'll slip out in the chaos. But how many would die? Stand clear, please. They'll Keep die walking so near. we can survive. Live. I managed to simulate the mainframe's native environment, the bunker. It'll be ready for the access codes in a moment. Listen, V. All hell breaks loose in two minutes. When Hanson flatlines, we haul ass. Oh, I'll block oh, access to this room. Alex and Reed are minimizing risk and exfilling early via the route. Here she is. In all her glory. Oh, and don't worry about us. Got that sorted already. Check stadium blueprints. No which way to run. So? Shall we? No turning back now. Nope. But we're in this together. Right, let me see. Oh, I can't do that right now. Damn. Ready. Linked. Is the connection clear? Thousandth of the decimal. It'll have to do. Time to get wet. Actuating the mainframe. Hansen suspects something. Just hasn't caught on yet. Soon it won't matter. Mm, I see. It's responding. Stay sharp. Almost open for input. Thank you. Really. Thank you for being here. Just a little more. Okay, your turn. It's ready for the access codes. Fuck me. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck. Damn. Okay, so this is going to launch us into the final mission of the DLC, right? I think. I have to be, go to the bathroom and <laughs> take a quick break. So I think so very much for it. Ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, um, when we return, we're going to do this and probably finish the DLC. We'll see. But until then, I thank you so very much. If you're on too, please like, comment, subscribe to us. Drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I will see you all in a moment. Mm -hmm.